Hey everyone, meteorologist Caitlin Fish here with your weatherwise lesson for today. Even though it's called hurricane season, not every storm that form becomes a hurricane. There are several different types of tropical weather systems known broadly as tropical cyclones. Here are five common definitions of a tropical system from birth to decay. We have a tropical wave first. These are somewhat disorganized areas of low pressure that move east to west across the tropics. Given enough time and a good environment, they can develop develop into a tropical cyclone. Next we have tropical depression. This is when things start to heat up just a bit. Depressions are tropical cyclones whose maximum surface winds are 38 miles per hour or less. This is determined using a one minute average of wind speeds. These cyclones can later evolve into a tropical storm. Tropical storms have maximum surface winds between 38 and 74 miles per hour and can produce a lot of rain. Hurricanes are the peak of tropical systems. Their cyclone development is advanced. Ranked on a scale from 1 to 5, hurricanes have sustained winds of 74 miles per hour or greater. They produce torrential rain and can cause devastating flooding. Eventually, hurricanes fizzle out and become post-tropical cyclones. These no longer have characteristics to be considered tropical, but they can still bring heavy winds, rain, and high winds. You may not think these storms can make uh, their way into Kentuckiana, but many have as post tropical cyclones and have caused a good bit of damage. That is your weather wise lesson for today. For WHAS 11, I'm meteorologist Caitlin Fish.